You are the glory of the Lord, and I really thank God for your manifestation in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. I love you all, and I honor you, and I trust the Lord that you all have been having a wonderful weekend. To God be the glory. Today, I just wanted to uh, bring this uh, word onto each and every one of us, because the Bible declares, according to the book of 1 Timothy, that we should pray for our leaders, those in authority. We have to pray for them. And the reason why we have to pray for them is because this is our part of our mandate in creation, because the Bible says that the government shall be upon your shoulders. So we're not supposed to be on their shoulders. They're supposed to be on our shoulders. And the reason why is is because you are a king and you are a priest you're here to rule and reign can you see that that is why majority of the time this government they are looking to you so that they can be saved they are looking to you so that you can declare the mandates of heaven upon creation can you see that so for that reason he says stand and watch so when you're standing and watching and you see that hey this government is going in the wrong direction you begin to lift up prayers so it's not about hey we are basically you know electing and selecting because of their policies and things like that no this is not about policies this is about the will of the father which says let my will be done on earth as it is in heaven in jesus mighty name amen and amen so it is for that reason i believe you know while i was uh, i came out of prayer and the father instructed to you know it was given a revelation a, a, a revelation basically and it's a place where you know uh, uh, there is just so much happening in 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 the government there is a shaking that is happening in the government in this hour and the shaking that is happening basically is in the dimension of sex scandals yes so i believe you know uh, the the spirit of the lord according to uh, uh, genesis i believe when the the spirit of the lord was hovering you know in egypt basically was moving around egypt and in genesis chapter 1 it says and the spirit of the Lord was hovering over the face of the deep and God said so now this is what the father is saying you know there are a lot of uh, I believe they call them madams I, I, you know that terminology and I believe these are people who are in charge of uh, prostitution basically uh, you know they basically organize women and they put them out there you know to be an escorts and things like that you know which is absolutely wrong because that is part of what a, a, a you know sex slave or kind of thing like that but it's a place that this has been grieving the father for a long time and this is where he's dealing with that situation yes because a lot of those people they are going to be what they are going to start getting arrested one way or the other the father is going to basically you know he's basically uncovering what has been hidden in the dark and a lot of them they are getting arrested in this hour and for that reason they are being turned in and while this is happening you're going to begin to see that a lot of them they're going to begin to give up the lists I'm sure a lot of us watch those movies where, you know, we watch some of these movies where a madame is in operation and she has a list of all her clients <laughs> just in case anything happens. You know, it's like her way out of all of it. But this is where the arrest is going to begin to happen. And when this arrest begin to happen, you're going to see that the list in which these people have, it includes, uh, you know, people in government. Yeah. Who have been involved in this uh, 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 prostitution as well. Can you see that? Yeah. They been basically you know they've been with um prostitutes with this madame getting girls and and things like that so for that reason the father is exposing in the government those who have been involved in this act so you're going to begin to see the madams get arrested and politicians exposed and the reason why the father is doing this is because he's cleaning up house daniel chapter 2 it says he's the one who what he deposes kings and he what he lifts them up so this is where he's deposing and he's deposing for those who have been in that and this is why i always encourage a lot of people that you know when you get involved in this in the book of ezekiel there is a loss that happens do you see that that is why the father is always encouraging that you what you confess your faults to one another but majority of these people they've spent money they've spent all of their resources in order to hide the truth that they don't get involved in all of this for some of them they are probably married and you know they basically involved themselves in they engage themselves in these things and because of that engagement engagement like i said do you see why i said adultery at the same time causes losses too so this is that which is manifesting upon creation so please continue to pray for what for our leaders 
you know, as the Lord begins to unveil this, it's not a place where we begin to condemn and, you know, ha, ah, I told you so, this person was doing this. Well, that can be true, but we need to walk in love and just what? And just pray for them. Do you know why? Because the Lord is looking to someone who will be able to show mercy because he wants to move in mercy in order to bring about mercy to those people because they need mercy too. Do you know that? It's not just you who need mercy. They need mercy because the Father tells us that he will show mercy to whomever he desires to show mercy to. So don't be afraid. Uh, or should I say, you know, don't, don't be surprised. That's the word that the Lord can show mercy to that person who you never thought deserved mercy. <laughs> you see the beauty of the Father? So I just wanted to release this, that we should please continue to pray for those in authority because you're going to begin to see it. And I believe, you know, a, a sign concerning Concerning this in itself, you know, was released recently uh, 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 in 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 the United Kingdom. You know, where a politician came, you know, was basically placed uh, uh, in public because of this and he had to resign. So this is where the father, you're going to begin to see that in creation, you know, all over. So it's not just a particular country. It's not just a particular state, but it's going to be all over. Because like I said, the spirit of the Lord is hovering over the face of the deep, not a face of a particular place. It's everywhere and it's uncovering what has been hidden for a long time. Amen. God bless you. You are the blessedness of the father. And I love you so very much in Jesus mighty name. Amen.